I'll fix it. June 2nd, 2023. Driving super duper 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 slow. Stopped, turned you guys on. Um, well, almost got to a stop. Basically, there's a motorcycle in front of me that looks like it's a Harley-ish thing, but like, I don't know. Like, he wants to carry a bunch of stuff. He's got a bunch of stuff in his uh, motorcycle things on the side. And then he's got like this big thing. Like, he's definitely like ready for whatever's. Um, and he's got the appropriate shoes, but then he doesn't have like pants on and he has shorts on. So I'm like really nervous if he like downs his bike or whatever it's called, like wipes out. There's a word for it. Um, Bruce, Pete, sorry, I, I don't remember what it's called. But like you lay down, lay down your bike. That's what it's called. Anyways, very concerned for that gentleman. Uh, he is evidently confident in his abilities as a driver. Uh, so first off, what is a Chevy Trax? Because uh, I just saw one and it was weird. Um, and I want to have like a personal, like I'm going to try to remember that as like a random thing of like, there's a new one and that's like kind of my brand. One of my brands. I have a lot of brands. Um, trailblazer. yes, that trailblazer is imposter. It's, it's a big trailblazer like mine. Um, cause I have the EXT, the LT EXT, even though it doesn't have the LT badges because for some reason, whatever, it had to get repainted after somebody like did some not nice stuff to it in a parking lot when I was at the movies for the first time watching a movie in like forever, which was the Magic Mike movie. And like, I'm obsessed with whoever that guy is. And I always forget his name, even though I really like him. I like, I think he'd be like the coolest guy to like meet with and like we'd be best buddies. And like, I have this whole little thing with him. Um, and I think it's like, and like the radio, he does all the fuzzy stuff too, which doesn't make it any better. I think it's like Channing. Yeah, I think it's Channing something. It starts with a T. I know, it's terrible. He's like one of my favorite guys. Um, but anyways, so I was just thinking to myself about like what I have to do and everything. And then I saw the bike and then I got distracted and then I saw the, the tracks thing. And then like the other thing that just made me so grumpy is like this whole autopiloting when you're driving around thing, which you guys might think I'm doing, but I'm really not. I'm really overly paying attention to like all the stuff and like I, respect people's boundaries so much that I'm respecting this inanimate object, this vehicle, to make sure that like I'm not getting close enough to smush him. So anyways, um, somebody had to like chunk over where they needed to get into the turning lane and like I was in the left lane and there was a right lane and so like I waited until there was an appropriate amount of space to like go around so that I could continue with the flow of traffic and I got home deck. And I'm like, dude, and you know what? The guy was on his phone. Like, how do you do that? How do you rationalize? Like, you look up for a split second and see somebody in front of you and honk when they've given you more than an amount of appropriate space. Like, wake up, people. You're too dedicated to your phones. I'm not dedicated to you guys as a phone. Okay? Not dedicated to you guys as a phone. You're literally sitting on my thing like my navigation would be doing and because I was able to autopilot from Walmart to here. And if you get kicked over and you see a different perspective, that's because I have GPS. I'm not staring at my GPS the whole time. I'm paying attention to everything that's around me. Why are people not paying attention to what's around them? Like right now, in this moment, I'm worried about Charlie's poopy diaper. I'm worried about Isabel's capacity for sleep. If she's actually going to eat bread or is she gonna eat the muffins? And the muffins are up here, so they're a visual reminder because probably need sugar because normally I eat candy because I have blood sugar crashes. And now she's remembering about the blueberry muffins. I'm remembering about the milk that I need to make sure that I have so that I don't have to stop somewhere and spend unwisely because my husband's like you're a spinny pants I'm like no I'm not I'm spinny pants of essential items and like he's a spinny pants and then I'm wondering like about the store like I'm wondering about all these things but I am really aware of my surroundings because my brain can process all this information at the same time and like I don't like texting people and driving I will pull over I do all these things but like that's the end of my soapbox pink thing things. what what pink things <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. It's too many things. But anyways, guys, pay attention to your stuff. Like, just pay attention. Pay attention to the motorcycles the around you. Pink things I don't know what she's talking about with these <laughs> pink things. And I do need, I sort of should have got the little things. And that's why I use Amazon. And then I shop, shop local. And then I try to use mom and pop places every now and then. Like, I try to do all the stuff. But, like, it's just very frustrating because I'm out here trying to teach kittens how to live responsibly. And, like... I'm getting honked at for dumb stuff. It's okay. Well, we're going to be done with the video because we have to change laundry. I will talk to you guys later. Izzy's frustrated because she's tired. She didn't take a nap even though she said she was going to. Bye, guys. Look me up. I'll see you next time. Bye.